Happy Resurrection Day. Today is a day where Christians around the world celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Jesus is someone who came to this world knowing exactly what his purpose was, and he fulfilled that purpose during Resurrection Day, where he died for the sins of the world. And although three days prior, which was Good Friday, those around him thought that all was lost because Jesus had died, and that they thought that his purpose and who he was must not have been. But three days later, on Resurrection Day, um, some call Easter Sunday, Jesus rose from the dead, fulfilled his purpose, and his purpose is still relevant today and in effect today. So my message to you today is what in your life needs to be resurrected? What in your life needs to be resurrected? All of us have purpose for the reason why we have incarnated on this planet. All of us, without exception. And I ask you, is there a dream, an idea, an invention, a purpose, a plan that it seems that because of circumstances in your life has died? Is there something that maybe you thought about when you were a child or when you were in your 20s or before life happened, before you had children or before you got married or before you had to start paying bills and having jobs? Is there something that's still there that needs to be resurrected? And so I say to you, and my message today is, if there is something something that you have not fulfilled, something that you think is dead in your life, a, a dream or a goal that you have in your life that needs resurrection. Let's get about the business of resurrecting it. Um, it's also here in the Northern Hemisphere, the time of spring. And spring is a time of renewal and um, the grass is turning green again, even though in the winter it looked like it had died with the cold and the snow. But every spring it comes back and it turns green again. The same thing with the deciduous trees. The leaves fall out, the trees look dead. But yet, here in the northern atmosphere, the trees are starting to bud again. They're starting to flower again. And spring is in the air and it smells beautiful. Again, I look at your life. What in your life has gone through that winter season where it, it looks like it's dead? It looks like it's not going to happen. It, you haven't given it attention in a while because you had to do other things in life. What needs to go through spring renewal in your life? What buds, what seeds need to start to sprout in your life so that you will have a harvest of what your dreams, goals, and aspirations are. I encourage, encourage you to really take, a, um, take some time, get quiet, and think about it. For some of you, you already know what it is. You're, you're thinking about it right now, and you're going, wow, yeah, you know, when I was eight years old, I wanted to do that. Or, yeah, I remember getting out of high school and saying, yeah, this is what I'm going to do. And now I'm in my 40s and I haven't done it yet. Just know it's not too late. It's, it's not too late at all. Today is a wonderful day to remind us of resurrection and how sometimes the very thing that looks like is dead, it looks like there is no hope, it looks like all hope is lost, is actually just in hibernation. And when it resurrects, it's going to be one of the most beautiful, fulfilling things that not only touches your life, but touches the lives of others. Thank you for watching, and again, happy Resurrection Day. If you would like to know more about 
the work I do, or you want to get some coaching on resurrecting your dreams, on planting those seeds in, and um, really preparing yourself for the harvest of your dreams and goals coming true. Contact me at www.drtjdixon.com. I would love to work with you. I'd love to talk to you because I love seeing people win and I love seeing people live their best lives. This is Dr. TJ Dixon. I'm signing off, connecting to your best life.